Hello guys and welcome to today's city update. Um, I want to make it quick. Today we want to focus on one specific problem and that is this gap that I talked about earlier. Um, I mean in another city update. So um, I, I have a little bit of an issue here. Um, so the beach is already like standing as you can kind of see here like five studs approximately off the table and um, because I moved the whole downtown area and stuff like that um, there is a 16 studs gap between this table and this like construction um, it works kind of well with the base plates if there's not too much weight on there it's it's holding on quite well um, but the gap back there is exactly the problem now what's what's exactly the problem um, because I have the skyscraper there and I want to keep it there um, I don't have one solid plate that is um, basically uh, bridging this gap and so that's kind of fragile uh, I'm gonna say um, no, basically there is there's just no mounting point for me to like extend this area so that I have something to build on and I'm gonna make it quick I have a solution for that and that is this it's an ugly old metal plate I'm probably gonna clean it before I use it but I want to put that under the table edge down there it's a little bit hard to reach like that of course straight you know um, but that will give me an edge I knocked something over that'll give me an edge to build off and yeah that's just what I'm going to do the problem is I think I will have to move the table leg because the the mounting plate for that would get in the way of this piece so that means probably taking the skyscrapers off the table and yeah then I'm gonna have to readjust that but let me do that now and then I'll see you again well that's an unusual way to look at the downtown area and this stuff <laughs> okay I'll continue working on this and then I'll show you the result okay guys I added this metal plate I had to move the table leg as I told you this was probably gonna happen um, but it wasn't actually too big of a struggle now as you can clearly see I it's, it's kind of under this road plate that I just took away a little bit see um, so I'll be able to also support the road plate a little bit which is fine you know that's just gonna add some strength and that's a good thing and what's amazing is that I just built this thing here and it perfectly matches up with the base plate height see that this is so perfect so now I'll build a frame out of Technic bricks and stuff like that to give this the proper strength and we'll see I think I might continue it a little bit further than this metal plate maybe actually going under this plate I'm not too sure but um, we're gonna make this very sturdy and let's see how that goes okay guys I basically have the Technic frame done and it's pretty pretty sturdy so um, as you can clearly see it's very simple basically it's just one row basically of uh, Technic bricks um, interlocking with some pins then two layers of plates and then another row of um, or another layer of Technic bricks and that way you you can connect them with lift arms three long lift arms and that will basically push them together and they will stick together extremely sturdily and I was able to kind of connect that in this side and it is very sturdy I really have to push down there to actually make it move and that's perfect that's exactly what we wanted so 
it it is on that metal plate from there to there approximately so it's it's not going anywhere this is very very sturdy it's I, I just really like how this how this turned out um, so if I just take the road plates firstly this curve we can easily put it on here like that and it's a lot better a lot more secure than before and as you can see I extended this frame um, up to here so now I have some extra um, support for this straight road plate there we go let's just put that in there this kind of moved so this is better now um, it could still bend a little bit if you push on this side but um, it's it's gonna be fine it's gonna be totally fine now the skyscraper isn't perfectly in position I kind of pushed it back so that I could build here a little bit better but yeah I will I will continue just filling in this space here but I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do that yet because I'm not exactly sure what kind of a surface I want to use in this general area um, because I don't have the final idea in my head on how I want to decorate this place and stuff like that so do I want to have like a concrete path going like this way and then um, I want to probably continue this wooden style from the pier a little bit I don't know it's I'm not quite finalized with that um, I I'm probably going to fill in like at least this area pretty sure that's gonna be like light douche gray concrete um, from the street going in there but um, yeah and then I can push the skyscraper over and then I can I don't know wait until I get the right inspiration and ideas so I will see if I can get some more work done in here and get this area kind of cleaned up because it's a mess right now and then I'm gonna show you the final progress for today okay there we go I filled in a little bit of this area and I covered that area with plates um, I kind of thought about it a little bit more I now got a little bit of a better idea how I want to build stuff in this area and because of that I just put the plates down that's definitely something that's not gonna change I know for sure that I need some sort of a good base there so I just put these down and in this spot well I filled in more parts um, there beneath the skyscraper because I moved that back in its right position it was it was moved back um, three starts something like that and I just um, brought it back basically um, so everything aligns perfectly and I'm just gonna use a 16 by 32 stud base plate right here that's gonna sit there perfectly and um, yeah pretty much that's just all I can really show you today um, the reason I'm not using normal plates here as well is firstly because I don't have normal plates and well it's just easier and cheaper for me to just use a base plate right there and yeah because like I don't have many big plates left and not really many in green or something like that so um, yeah I'm kind of running out of pieces with project projects like that but this is where we are going to end today's city update I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one